think he has a chance to live. This is the face of animal abuse. It breaks your heart. A striped male short hair cat suffering from brain swelling and other injuries. At this point, about a 50-50 chance for survival. Getting hands-on care from Dr. Dana Miller. You just wonder why. A commuter found the cat hanging from this utility pole in rural Geneseo Monday evening. A day after Easter, its paw was nailed to the pole. Blood visible nearly a day later. It made me sick to my stomach and I, you know, immediately got very upset and I just couldn't understand how someone could do such a thing. Driving home from work, Andrea Bristol stepped into action, calling authorities and rescuing the cat. It hardly moved at all. It was in really rough shape. It, it looked like it had been beaten up before it got nailed to the pole. And so it was hardly breathing, hardly moving at all. Residents say the cat was an inseparable pal with a neighbor who died recently. Lester Forbes continued feeding it. It's so cruel to the animals. Um, we're supposed to take care of our animals, not, not uh, abuse them. While the next 24 hours will be critical, the cat will likely be placed in the Henry County Humane Society. That's where it will receive care and love before it can go to a new home. A close look at the innocent animal is sure to spark emotions over this case, hoping now for answers. Um, I do hope they catch whoever did it. It's a senseless crime. I hope they can find them and, and pay with to the full extent that they can, you know, and, and get punished for it. The face of animal abuse that's keeping this cat fighting to survive. In Atkinson, John David, WQAD, Quad Cities News 8. That's the only reason we know